Hi guys, it's me. Do 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 do. Hello. Today we will talk about making money as a programmer. I know a lot of side methods that you can use to make some money. Some of them it can be like a full-time job. Some of them can be addition to your full-time job. Some of the methods can be just like build it once and earn money forever without effort. So I think it will be kind of interesting topic and it can be helpful for you. Maybe some of you will not use all of them or will not make a business. Sometimes it will be just after our project, but probably for some of you it can be kind of starter to make a good prospering business or company and you will be able to earn a lot of money on that maybe make you main way of making incomes let's start the first method i would like to tell you about is to being freelancer maybe being a freelancer for some of the people is not like the most stable and most profitable method to getting money, some of you probably don't know how to start, but I can make you sure a lot of people who know how to do it, who have some reviews and good portfolio, they make freelancing as a very, very profitable way of making money. Some of them are getting tons of the jobs, clients are waiting in the line for them, they can select with who they would like to work and they can work for example two hours per day and make a lot a lot of money. To be a good freelancer for sure you need to start with a good portfolio. Sometimes it's worth to do some jobs for free to build a nice projects and remember always you need to care about your clients. You need to make them happy as much as you can. Sometimes it's good to give them discount if you will do something a bit late or do some bonus to the work. If you will have a lot of good reviews, good contacts and good portfolio, it's impossible to not make success. The second way how I know and a lot of people probably use it's full-time job. Full-time job is the most stable has big benefit because have paid working days from your first day if you get it but the main problem with full-time job especially if you have no experience is how to get it because uh, most of the companies are looking for experienced people only few of them are looking for juniors or trainee sometimes if you are a trainee the job can be even for free or paid very very low but it's definitely worth to do it and there is some kind of maybe cons of getting full-time job because you in most of the cases you need to work from x to x hour in the place that your boss will choose anyway some of the jobs can be remote so you will work from home whatever however you would like and there is one very good thing about full-time job even if you are a junior if you will be motivated enough you will be in the good company you can upgrade your career and salary from the junior to the very good paid senior role sometimes even in two years it's time for the wordpress known and uh, very good method of making some passive income is to create a WordPress plugin or template. If you will create WordPress plugin on template, it can be a really lovely, almost 100% passive income. It means if you will create the plugin or template, you will not need to engage so much effort in it later. Not in every case, but in most of them. You can, for example, create the plugin, go into a lot of marketplaces and start selling it. Some of the marketplaces will even create, uh, do marketing for you. They will show your product to their clients just for a few percent of that. So you don't need to worry about it. just one thing that you really need to worry about are uh, requirements that marketplaces have, because sometimes you will need to create 
a really deep advanced settings panel for your small plugin or you will need to create a lot of documentation and sometimes you need to provide some time of the support that can be a lot of time that you will need to put into the small plugin always you need to calculate if it's worth in most cases yes it's what we are doing now ah at least we are trying to do but some of you like it so maybe it's not that bad Maybe it's even good. You can show us in the thumb ups. Uh, YouTube channel is something that uh, it's something like television was few years ago, but with one big difference. Everybody can do it. You can just take a camera or smartphone. You don't need even micro microphone. If people will like you for sure, you will earn money for better camera, better microphone for stuff and you will learn everything. You can just take simple stuff and start a recording, giving people an valuable content or entertainment, it's up to you. If you will have nice content, you will get a lot of followers and you will get a lot of money from the ads or whatever. Because on YouTube, you can earn money in few different ways. It's not only advertisements. You need to remember YouTube is not a fully passive income. It's something like you will need to put your content consistently, but it's definitely worth to do it. App development is something what I really love. It's something that I started from, I do all the time for years, and it's something what probably I will do even if I will be grandpa. It's giving me a lot of fun. Uh, this method it can be a lot of similar to creating WordPress plugin, but with few differences. With app you have not really in the limits. You can create whatever would you like. You can use, for example, JavaScript and create application by one code for a lot of platforms like desktop, web mobile even some browser extensions and with the app you can make from it really profitable business uh, a lot of big companies which are now they were starting in garage as a after hours project so it's definitely something that you can try to do something what we not only me my team members are doing daily now it's a very nice method, we have a lot of fun with that and uh, it's a method, of course, you need a lot of knowledge about the topic you would like to show, you need to spend a lot of time to create the courses, but if you will create one course, you can just start selling it, especially if you will join some education marketplaces, there is a lot of them, they will take care about your marketing, promotion, they will take care about your payments and will just be sending every month payments from your clients to your bank account, they will invoice them. So you don't need to care so much if you will create good course, it can be just sold by somebody and you will be earning money. Blogging is something that I do as well and my teammates are doing daily as well. I really like writing, so for me it's easier, for example, than recording video. I'm a bit stressed when I'm recording video. When I'm writing, uh, it's much, much easier for me. With blogging, if you would like to earn money on just advertisements, probably you will need massive amount of content. You can use a lot of more methods of making money from the blogs. You can have own product that you will be pro promote on. You can do some affiliate. You can do some sponsor posts, like take a partnership with some company and start showing their product. You have a lot, a lot of ways that you can do for the money on blogging. And starting blog, it's not very difficult. You can just create blog on a free platform and start doing it. It can be profitable as well, you don't need to like whole IT infrastructure to start it. You need to remember there are few topics that can be more and less profitable. For sure uh, topics as uh, finance or banking or IT or machine learning or and uh, like biotechnology can be much more profitable if you will have the same amount of visitors that you will have with less paid. 
you would like to write a book, you will need similar skills as for a blogging. It just few differences because you will need to do some marketing, create one ebook. It will take, it can, it doesn't need to, but it can take a lot of time for you because some ebooks have like 300 page or something. But if you will create an ebook, it will go popular, it can give you a lot, a lot of money from that and it will be 100% passive income. Are you a gamer with tech skills? If yes, this method for sure is for you. I love gaming, but I'm not very good game developer, so I don't do it. Anyway, uh, this method can be very profitable. You don't need a lot of effort in that because now we have already frameworks like, for example, Unity or Cocos. So you can use one of them. You will get some already sets like behavior of characters or physics. If you don't do a design, you can buy like ready-made assets like characters or landscapes. So in this case, you can do development of a nice game only by one person. You don't need a whole business and whole team for that. For example, you can create small game like mobile game with micro payments. If we go popular, it will be really, really good money on that. A lot of people think bug bounty hunting is only for very advanced hackers. Nothing more wrong. Actually, you can start with uh, bug bounty hunting with even minimal knowledge about the security and without knowledge of coding at all. Of course, if you know few programming languages, if you are security expert, probably you will get rich really, really quickly. But even beginners can try. For example, you can learn like top 10 OWASP or some another popular uh, web app security bugs and you, you can start just looking for them. You can register in bug bounty programs and start working on them. Some of the bug bounties are very, very well paid. Coding challenges and hackathons are a really good idea, maybe not only for making money, but during hackathons or coding challenges, especially if they're alive, you can meet a lot of people, you can make a lot of IT friends, it's a really good atmosphere there, maybe you can find some contacts to a recruiters or a recruiter will find contacts to you. And uh, what is really nice about that, you can build huge code portfolio as well what will make you like looking for a job later much easier if you will win some prizes you can go be famous in the IT world you can be kind of IT rockstar that can make you a heavy heavy player in the salary negotiation it's definitely worth to try now a lot of people would like to join IT industry or boost their career immediately so you can try kind of coding mentorship or programming mentorship or maybe even IT career mentorship like the personal trainer is not only for fitness personal development or mind development it's for everybody and in every industry if are people who would like to do some results much faster and is somebody who can help them <coughs> achieve that you can do it this is not only a profitable way but it can give you a lot of fun, it can make your like IT friends network much bigger, you can find some nice colleagues and you can make somebody's life better. If you have a lot of ideas or knowledge would, that would, you would like to share, but you don't like to be on the camera or you don't like to be you don't like to write so much uh, blog posts or maybe you have not so much time for that i think podcasting can be a great way for you it can be really easy to start because you don't need to have like professional studio you can start podcasting even when commuting to work by car or i know lying in the bed first podcast doesn't have to be like Pro. With podcasts, it's one good it's one good fact as well because if you will get some knowledge about podcasting, probably you will not spend a lot of time in the post production. What is much much better about them, 
Maybe podcasting is not the best and the fastest way to get the money from the first day, but it's a lot, lot smaller competition than in YouTube or in blogging. So you will have less competition and still big demand for the audio. It can be great and be make your channel big much faster. Congratulations! Now you know how you can make money. You know some of the methods that you can use and some of the methods that uh, maybe will be really helpful for you. Or maybe some of you will be a real businessman now. If yes, or if even no, contact us, send us in the comment, give us thumb up and tell us about your methods. Maybe you need any help, maybe you need some information how to start one of the methods, maybe you will be a good option for be a partnership with us. So feel free to let us know. And remember, subscribe our channel. See you in the next video. Bye.